Okay, so here's the situation. So a lot of you maybe know I've been traveling a lot this summer. I was in LA for the past month working with ZHC and now I'm in San Francisco visiting my friend Ava. She's let me stay here for about two weeks. She's a long time best friend and so I decided I was gonna surprise her with a painting and I've been a little sneaky about it because I was wondering what she would want me to paint if she were to have a dream painting. So I went on her Pinterest and I saw one of her favorite pins and I think it would be an amazing painting. So this is my plan for what I'm gonna paint. But the thing is, I leave in four days. Um, so I have to really rush and try and finish this so I can surprise her on the day that I go. So let's get going so I can finish this in time. July 6th. It is now the day before I leave and um, I mean I've made really good progress so far. I've done a lot of the stuff that takes the most amount of time in this piece like both of the portraits so now I just have to crack on and do the rest of the landscape but I'm planning on doing this really impressionistic so hopefully it shouldn't actually take that long but we'll see hopefully I can get it done for today so I can surprise her but maybe I'll have to leave it with her and she can get surprised in the morning before I fly. We'll see. The kiss of Venus has got me on the go. She scored a bullseye in the early morning glow. Then I asked to have you read the paper. Okay, people talking about which side they're taking. And if you know the baby, what's your take on it? Does it make you want? So, I'm not gonna lie, this was a really weird little classical music stress attack I was having, but this was pretty much based on me realizing there was no way I was gonna finish the piece in the three days that I gave myself. Well, okay, hear me out. I could have, I definitely could have, but with the way it was going, it was one of my favorite pieces so far, and so I just really wanted to do a good job at this point. So I had to come up with a new plan. I was flying back to Toronto in my home studio literally the next day, so I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna pack it up finish it there and then surprise her over FaceTime and mail it to her. So that was a new plan. Have you been the paper? People talking inside no education. Yeah, I go to college. a little bit of a work break right now because I've been working all morning. Uh, it's not going exactly how I expected. I think a big misconception with artists is that we know 100% of the time where the piece is necessarily gonna go 
or like how we're gonna do it. But especially this, this is completely uncharted territory for me and I don't exactly know what I'm doing. But to be honest, I think persistence is a really good character trait um, and just not giving up. So I'm just layering paint um, and hoping for the best, to be honest. I can't wait to see it fully done, so. The thing yeah. that I might suggest is that her hair doesn't stand out at all. I'm a little confused with like, that little brown part on the other side kind of thing blurs into the flower and kind of gets confused with the blade of grass there. So yeah, we'll yeah, yeah, I'll do a better job at Awesome. Yeah. Thank you, man. Awesome. I love this. Uh, I, yeah. Yeah. I can't wait to see it. It's so, so cool. Like, Callum. I gave it all for fantasy. Is anybody gonna remember me? If I go tonight, I doubt the world will change. I just pray they don't forget my name. These are game rules I can't lose. When it's all said and done, will I still be cool? Spent like 10,000, 20,000, 30,000, 40,000. How much I'ma spend profiling? She come in and compliment my closet. Fuck her on the floor like I don't give a fuck about it. Your judgment get cloudy when you cloud it. My opposition wish I'd stop smiling. My family wish I'd stop wilding. I'm still on the east side smoking with my OG. Cause they the only ones that really know me. I almost can't believe I'm saying this, but the painting is done. And you're not gonna believe my luck, but Ava came into town today, so I get to surprise her in person. So I'm gonna go hide this camera somewhere and let's show her the painting and see what she thinks. I really hope she likes it and I'm kinda nervous, but let's see. We gave her the piece. Ava's happy, so I'm happy. No, but honestly, it was really, really cool being able to give her that piece because I know she'll enjoy it for the rest of her life. And it was just a cool, unique way of showing my appreciation for all that she's done for me. If you enjoyed watching, please like and subscribe. I know I haven't been posting a lot lately, but I've officially graduated university now and I'm gonna be doing art full time. And so there will be lots of cool new content and painting videos coming very, very shortly. But thank you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your day.